This is J.C. DeLass with this week's Fidelis Care Coaches Corner, and joined this week by our special guest, Paul Dodderwich, who's the head swimming and diving coach here at SUNY Geneseo. Coach, you've been voted SUNYAC Coach of the Year 14 times since taking over this program in 2001, so let, let's start right there. What's been the secret to your success here? You know, J.C., I think the secret to our success and sustaining that success is, is the culture that we've built here. You know, we put a lot of time into a, a values-based culture, uh, and then we recruit to that culture. I think that's really important. Every recruit that comes to our campus uh, as a student athlete interested in swimming and diving, you know, I'm up front with them. We have a, a values-based uh, system here, and I, I show them our value statement, and, and I tell them right up front, if, if this isn't you, then we may not be the right fit for you. Uh, and in the end, what we end up with are the kids that, that buy into our program and, and have similar values and believe in what we're doing. And that, uh, that really allows us to sustain the level that we've had over the years. When you get the student athletes here, are you fine tuning their technique or are you kind of starting from scratch or are you just working with what you have, what their skills are? A little bit of both. You know, we're always trying to fine tune the technique of the athletes. I think that's really important. But at the same time, it, it, we're kind of limited in the amount of time that we have them. You know, we've got them for 19 weeks for four years. Uh, so to do a complete overhaul of an athlete's technique would be really challenging for us. So I would say we're more fine tuning or massaging the technique a little bit, you know, and coming up with a few things here and there that they can improve on. You were talking about recruiting, and that's certainly the lifeblood sure. of, of any program. Is there a, a certain type of student athlete that you're looking for? when you're bringing a kid here to Sudin Geneseo? Yeah, I mean, first they have to be a student. You know, the academic rigor here is, is pretty high. Uh, so it's important that we find people or student athletes that, that uh, understand that academics is first. Uh, but otherwise, we're looking for athletes that already have good technique. You know, I'll take somebody that hasn't trained quite as hard but has really sound technique, and then we can build on that, you know, and train them a little bit better or a little bit push them a little bit further in the pool training-wise. Uh, those are typically the athletes that we see with the greatest improvement. You're the men's and women's swimming and diving coach. Sure. How is that different, coaching men, coaching women? I mean, do you have to really kind of come about it two different ways? You know, we're, we do have two teams, men's and women, but we do everything together. We train together, we travel together, our meets are together. So, you know, the atmosphere is definitely a little bit different when we separate. You know, there are some days where we'll have uh, women's only practice or men's only practice. Uh, and I would say those days, um, it's a, it's a little bit easier, you know, than when you have both of the, the genders in at the same time. So it definitely does present a few challenges. Let's wrap up this up now with a quick thought, the best part about coaching here at SUNY Geneseo. Man, I think the best part about coaching at Geneseo and Geneseo in general is the community and, and the culture that we have, not only within our team, but the campus and the community outside of the campus as well. You know, I think you've seen that this year firsthand. Uh, you know, they really, they're great students here. They're great professors that are really vested in the students. Uh, the staff within the athletics department, I've, I've worked at other colleges and this is by far the best. Uh, it makes it easy to come to work every day and be excited about what you're doing. Thanks for joining us, Coach. No problem. Thank you. And thank you for joining us for this week's Fidelis Care Coaches Corner.